Hello everyone, myself Ramji Patel. This is my fourth video on Easy EDA. In my previous video, I discussed on bus, bus entry and net level wiring tools. Today in this video, I am going to discuss about commonly library and online library in Easy EDA. So let's get started. For designing a schematic diagram in Easy EDA, we need the symbols of electronic component. We can get these symbols in commonly library. So here is the basic symbols of some electronic components and here is the ground, here is the VCC, here are the symbols of registers and variable registers, here is the symbols of capacitor, here is the symbols of inductors and here is the symbol of battery connectors and here is the symbols of headers and here is the symbol for USB connector and DB9 connector and here is the symbol for switch and button and here is the symbols for LED, diode, transistors, MOSFET and here is the symbols for voltage regulator and here is the symbols for variable or adjustable voltage regulator and here is the symbol of the 7 segment display and here is the symbol of an OLED display and here is the symbol of a 16 by 2 character LCD screen and here is the symbol of an LCD display. So we can select a symbol from the commonly library, bring the pointer of your mouse on the symbol and then press the left key of your mouse and then drag the cursor on the canvas and then again press the left key of the mouse place the symbol. To place multiple symbols, press the left key of the mouse many times and then press the right key of the mouse to select a new symbol. To delete a symbol, select the symbol and press the delete key of your keyboard. You can also do this by just selecting the symbol and right clicking on your mouse key and then delete. You can also rotate the component by selecting it and pressing the R key of the keyboard or by pressing the space key of the keyboard. You can also flip the component according to Y axis or X axis. For that, select the component and press the X key to flip the component along X axis. And press the Y key of the keyboard to flip the component along Y axis. You can also do this uh, just by selecting the rotate left, rotate right, flip horizontal or flip vertical. For that, select the component and then go to format and then press rotate left, rotate right, flip horizontal and flip vertical. Now again go on the symbol and here is the drop down menu. So click on the drop down menu and here are some other symbols that you can set if you set this symbol then easy EDA will keep the symbol until you change the symbol again and here is the symbol for register this is the US symbol and this is the European symbol you can, you can select US symbol or European symbol according to your desire. I am a fan of European symbol so I always use European symbol for designing these my schematic diagrams. Here is the US symbol of potentiometer and here is the European symbol of the potentiometer. Here is the US symbol of ceramic capacitor and here is the European symbol of the ceramic capacitor and here is the US symbol of polar capacitor 
and here is the European symbol of the polar capacitor and here is the US symbol of inductor and here is the European symbol of the inductor and by clicking on the drop down menu we can also select their SMD package or the THT package same for register we can choose the SMD packages or THT packages here is the symbol for battery we can also choose the SMD package of the battery or THT package here is the symbol for DC connector we can also choose the package according to current rating and here is this symbols for mail headers this is for single mail header and this is for 5 mail header and this is for 20 mail headers and here is the symbol for female header we can select 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 female headers and here is the symbol for 2 cross 2, 2 cross 7, 2 cross 8 and 2 cross 20 male headers and here is the symbol for 2 cross 2, 2 cross 3, 2 cross 4 female headers and here is the symbol for screw terminals 2P stands for 2 screw terminal 3P stands for 3 screw terminal and here is the symbol for USB connector so this is for USB type A male connector USB type A female connector you can also watch the footprint of your symbol just by selecting your symbol and clicking on the footprint so you here you can watch the footprint of your symbol this is the footprint of the capacitor this is also the footprint of the capacitor this is the footprint of the variable register this is also footprint of the register and here is the footprint of the polar symbol of the capacitor so in this way you can watch the sim the so in this way you can watch the footprint of your symbols and here is the switch this is the tactile switch and this is the slide switch we can also select some other packages of the switches and here is the LED we can either choose the SMD package of the red green blue led or the tht package of the led here is 3 mm led and here for 5 mm led and here we can select the diode symbol the symbol of 1 and 4007 smd diodes tht diode and here is the symbol for 1 and 4148 SMD diode and THT diode and here is the symbol of an NPN bipolar junction transistor the 2N3904 is a standard NPN transistor and it is the SOT23 package of the transistor we can also use the drop down menu to change the symbol from NPN to PNP 
and 2N3906 is a standard PNP transistor and here is the symbol for N channel MOSFET we can also change from N channel to P channel with the help of drop down menu and here is the symbol of LM7805 regulator and the package of the regulator is TO220 we can also change the package SOT89, TO220, TO252 and here is the package for the other voltage regulator this is the voltage regulator with output voltage of 5 volts this is the voltage regulator for output voltage of 9 volt the last digit represents the output voltage so here is 5 which means the output voltage of the regulator is 5 volt and here is the last digit is 1 2 so this shows that the output voltage of the regulator is 12 volt 7 8 basically a series of regulator and here is the symbol of the voltage regulator this is the symbol of positive voltage regulator and this is the symbol of negative voltage regulator and here is also the symbols of voltage regulator but these are variable or adjustable voltage type volt positive voltage regulator and negative voltage voltage regulator and here is the symbol of the seven segment display by clicking on the drop down menu we can select either common cathode or common anode we can also select two display two seven segment display in a single package three seven segment display in a single package and four seven segment displays in a single package before selecting symbol from the commonly library it is important to select the right package of the component if you don't know what is packaging of electronic component then in my next video i will explain packaging of electronic components now here is the online library so we can also take the symbols of the electronic component from the online library Suppose I want to use uh, the symbol of the simple 5 timer IC but the symbol of the simple 5 timer IC is not available in the commonly library. So here we use the online library but to use the online library your computer must be connected to internet otherwise you cannot use the online library on EasyEDA. So then click on online library and here you just need to type the name of the component for example I, I want to use the NE55 timer IC so just type NE5555 NE and press enter and here is a list of NE55 timer IC Here are different packages because the triple five timer IC is available in many packages TST package, SMD package, DIP package, SOIC, SOP. You can select your package according to your requirement. You can also see the symbol of the package that we have choose. Here is the symbol for this package and here is the footprint for this package and here is the physical look of the component. Here are two search engines Easy EDA and LCSC Electronics. So LC Electronics is a supplier of electronic component. So we can also use the 
component supplied by the LCLC electronics. We can also select the symbol footprint, spy symbol, SCH module and PCB module and also the 3D model. So here you can see the 3D models of digital file timer IC. And in classes, here is the workspace. So in the workspace, uh, all the symbols and footprints that you design in Easy EDA is always stored in workspace class. And here is the user contributed class. So you can also use the symbols of symbols or footprint of other users in your schematic. Now take another example. Suppose that I want to use the LM741 operational amplifier IC. So for that type LM and then 741 and press enter. Select the LCSC since I want to use the symbol so click on symbol. And here is the symbol and here is the footprint and here is the physical look of the component. So now you will understand how you can use symbols from commonly library and online library to design your schematic diagram. If you have any doubt then you can ask me on forum. Thanks for watching.